Yu-Gi-Oh! What is up YouTube, this is Jeremy from Team Bio, and today guys, we are back with the combo tutorial and test hands that I promised you in the last video for the Red Eyes deck profile. So I told you that we have two card combos to get into our Triple Flare Metal Dragon, as long as we do not get hand trapped. So, for the combos actually, um, there's two different ways you can do it. Is actually One is having Dragon Shrine in your hand with either Mathematician or Draconet. And then the other combo is having Dark Worm in your hand with your Sinet Mining. So I'll go through both of these combos just so you guys can see how diverse this combo to get into it is. And yeah, so we'll go ahead and use the Sinet Mining, if I can grab these, the Sinet Mining and Dark Worm combo first. So what we'll do is we'll activate the Sinet Mining by discarding the Dark Worm to search for our Draco Net. Then we'll activate Dark Worm's effect, summoning in the far left zone. Then using his effect to search for Supreme King uh, Gate Zero. Then we'll just activate Gate Zero so we don't forget later in the combo. Normal summon your Draco Net. Use this effect, summon your Guard Dragon from deck. And then you can Synchro 5 into your Ib. Uh, activate Ib's effect. In this case, it doesn't really matter what you search out of the World Legacy cards. Uh, you could search for your Guard Dragon, World Legacy Guard Dragon, or you can search for your Succession because in this combo it doesn't matter because you don't use either one of them, but we'll just search for our Succession. Next, link these two. Uh, this goes into your extra monster, or your extra deck because it's a Pendulum Monster. Into your Cyframe Lambda. Um, the only reason we play Lambda, like I said in the deck profile, is just because of the generic materials and the arrows. Uh, once the Buster Blader link comes out, we'll, we'll put, definitely play that over it. But continuing, um, sorry, Ib's effect is going to summon from our deck our World Chalice Scar Dragon. Then we'll link this away for our Pisty. And then we'll banish the Guard Dragon. We'll put our banish zone right here for our Guard Dragon Justicia. Let's see, next, banish, or not banish, link into LP. We'll activate our LP's effect, summoning a dragon from our deck, that dragon being Black Metal Dragon. Link these two into our Romulus. Activate Romulus's effect as chain link one, Black Metal chain link two to search. Uh, black Metal will search Red Eyes, Romulus will search Ravine. So a lot of people ask me during my combos why don't why I don't search for Red Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon. You don't use that in this variant of the combo. And I'll show you how. So we're gonna activate our ravine, then use this effect discarding the red eyes to send our Oh no, I lost it. Our Destrudo. If I can find it. There you are. Send our Strudo. Then we'll link these two away into our Triple Burst Dragon. Activate Pisty's effect again. Or not again, but for the first time. We'll bring back our Black Metal Dragon. Link Triple Burst and Pisty, since they're both Dark Dragons, into Darkness Metal of the Dragon Dark Steel. Then, from our graveyard, we activate Destrudo's effect, paying 4,000 life to summon it. Sync, Destrudo will go to the bottom of your deck into Odd Eyes Meteor Burst Dragon. Uh, Meteor Burst Dragon is going to be Chain Link 1, Target Supreme. Uh, Black Metal is going to be Chain Link 2, searching for your Malefic. Resolve, add Special, and then you will activate Black, or you'll summon the Red Eyes Malefic Black Dragon by banishing a red eyes from your deck. Next, you'll activate, oops, you'll activate Darkness's effect, special red eyes, overlay into Flare Metal. Activate Flare Metal's effect, quick effect, you can detach to target one red eyes monster in your graveyard, red eyes, black dragon, the other one in our graveyard, special summon it. Next, oops, pushing cards everywhere. Overlay these two into the second red eyes. Activate effect, 
detach the red eyes, especially the second red eyes, and then overlay. And the only downside about this is obviously we lose two impermanence. Uh, we lose the dark ruler no more. But like I said in the uh, deck profile, this is just a for fun. I forgot to put the red eyes on top of them. <laughs> the just for fu for fun deck. And then the only drawback about this guy is you can't link. Otherwise, we could have activated a World Legacy Succession, linked him and the Nether Dragon into our um, Heretic Seal, and then linked to get or uh, overlaid into the third red eyes. So that is it for combo one. Let me pause the video. I'll get all the resources back together and I will show you guys combo number two. All right, guys, so we are back. And for the second combo, you can use, or you have to use Dragon Shrine and you can either use your uh, Mathematician or your Draco Net. Um, you guys know how Draco Net works. You just summon the level two from your deck. So this, in this combo, we'll just use Mathematician and we'll hop right into it. So these will be in your hand. We'll put the hand over here. We'll activate our Dragon Shrine. And how we're gonna do this is we're actually going to send our Red Eyes Black Dragon as a normal monster. And Dragon Shrine says if you send a normal monster, you can send an additional dragon. So we're gonna send our Supreme King Dark Worm. Next, we'll activate Dark Worm's effect, bring him back. You have to summon him for sure in this combo in the far left zone. So Mathematician in our hand. Uh, activate Dark Worm's effect, add the Supreme King Gate Zero, then activate it just so we don't forget. Next, summon your Mathematician, activate his effect. We're going to send our Carbonet on, banish Carbonet on, to summon our Ib from, or not our, well, I keep calling it Ib, Guard Dragon just to see it. Sink into our Ib, finally. Then activate her effect. In this case, we will be using the card that we searched, so we're going to add Guard World Legacy Guard Dragon, and then activate it using its effect to special back our Justicia. Next, link these two into our Cypher and Lambda. Activate Ib's effect. We're going to summon our World Chalice, uh, World Chalice Guard Dragon, excuse me, from our deck. Link that away. Pisty, activate its effect, banish, summon, link into LP. Then it's pretty much the same from here. Activate LP's effect, we get to summon a guy from deck. Summon black metal, link these two into our Romulus. Activate Romulus chain link one, black metal chain link two. Instead of adding red eyes this time, we're gonna add, actually add our red eyes darkness metal. And then obviously off of Romulus, add a dragon ravine. Next, we activate Dragon Ravine, and we're actually going to use it discarding the Red Eyes Darkness to send our Distrudo. Next, we link those two into our Triple Burst Dragon. We're going to activate Pisty's effect, bringing back our Red Eyes Darkness, and then activate Red Eyes Darkness effect, bringing back our Black Metal Dragon. Next, we're going to link all of these guys, because they're all dark dragons if you don't believe me dark dragon dark dragon dark dragon dark dragon they're all dark dragons into our darkness metal sadly he doesn't have an effect like Ceruja where you can draw but he's still really good so since you did use uh red eyes black metal or black metal dragon uh you do get to use this effect again to search so we add our Malefic Red Eyes Black Dragon. Next, we're going to special it in the left zone uh, by banishing Red Eyes from deck. Next, we activate Distrudo, paying half our life by targeting Dark Worm. Sink these, bottom of the, extra, or bottom of the deck, and that one will go to the extra deck, into our Odd Eyes. Activate Odd Eyes effect, summon and then we're going to activate Red Eyes' effect, summon this guy back. And then this probably looks very familiar. Overlay. Use effect. Detach. Target the other one. Overlay. 
detach, target the other one, and then overlay for the final Red Eyes Flare Metal Dragon. And that is how you consistently, with two cards, multiple variations, end on Triple Flare Metal Dragon. So as you guys know, I do like doing test hands for you, so uh, I'm going to pause the video one more time, shuffle the deck a little bit off camera, and I will get right back to you with the test hands. Alright, so we are back, and I will show you real quick. We did shuffle the deck a little bit. I'll shuffle it a couple times on camera so you guys know I'm not trying to cheat you. But I will show you three test hands, uh, and hopefully at least two out of the three we can get into our triple flare metal. Remember, as always, as every test hand I do, we are playing ideal Yu-Gi-Oh! No hand traps, we won the die roll, we are going first. Real ideal Yu-Gi-Oh! would be every time opening our combo, but we will see. So five cards, try to keep that in frame. And so this actually isn't too bad. Um, let's see what we'll do in this scenario. Uh, I would probably activate the Sign at Mining. Ooh. By discarding uh, Black Metal Dragon. So we'll try to keep our hand right there. Resolve Sign at Mining. Where are you at? Add Draco Nut. We'll obviously be going back in a lot, so we'll normal summon our Draco Nut, activate its effect, summon our Guard Dragon, sink into, I didn't even organize my extra deck, our Ib, activate Ib's effect, add Succession. Uh, next, activate World Legacy Guard Dragon. We're actually going to bring back our red eyes just because we can because it does not have to be a normal monster which i didn't know at first but we just revive it back link these two into our rom or not our romulus sorry our lambda uh chain link one ib chain link two black metal uh we do want to try to chain block ib if possible so black metal will add Malefic Flare, Ib will summon World Chalice Guard Dragon. Our hand is actually crazy, guys. Link this away into LP. Banish this. We'll just put that one off screen. Summon Justice back. Link it to Pitsty. Uh, we'll activate LP's effect. We will summon another black metal from our... Ooh, you know what? We'll summon a dark worm from our deck. And as long if I'm correct, it, LP does not negate the effects if this will focus. Yeah. LP does not negate the effects. That focus is bad. So we can add our... Maybe if I can find it. Do, 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 do. There you are. Supreme King. We'll activate that on the far left. This is still our hand. And the reason we can summon this is because he is a dragon. Link. Extra deck. Just put it up there. Into our Romulus. Romulus' effect. Add Dragon Ravine, activate Dragon Ravine. Um, yeah, this is not bad at all. So we'll go ahead and activate Dragon Ravine's effect, tribute the red eyes, or not tribute the red eyes, discard the red eyes, send Destrudo, uh, link these. Triple Burst, activate Pisty's effect. Let's see. We'll go ahead and actually no, we won't activate Pisty's effect. We'll activate or we'll use the summoning condition for Malefic Red Eyes in the far right zone. 
by banishing a red eyes from our deck. I forgot that Pisty actually had this other cool effect. So red eyes is banished. Should probably put that a little more in frame. Because I forgot Pisty can actually summon from the banished zone. So we'll summon red eyes from the uh, banished zone. We'll bring you back down here. Link these two into our red eyes. Then these are still in our hand, so we'll go ahead and activate red eyes' effect, or alternative, attributing the red eyes, summon himself. We'll go ahead and, let's see, activate darkness' effect, bring him back. We can't. Uh, X or uh, link someone for the rest of the turn, but that's fine because we are going to end on our triple flare metal again. Activate effect by detaching red eyes. Bring back the other red eyes in our grave. I should probably put this in line a little better. This is just such a bad. angle. Uh, next, overlay these two into another red eyes. Then we'll actually use World Legacy Successions effect. Bring back our black metal dragon. And then activate Distrudo's effect. Make him a level 6. Sync. He'll go to the bottom of the deck. And we'll summon our Odd Eyes. Activate Odd Eyes effect, chain link one, black metal chain link two. Summon black metal, we'll search for red eyes darkness metal. Only if we could link summon again. I probably could have done this a little better where we didn't have to use uh, red eyes' effect, but it's, it's all right. We have follow up plays for next turn. Anywho. We overlay these two into our final triple flare metal. And then we have red eyes in hand, and if we want to, we can just scoot you way over here. So that is test hand one. Um, not bad. I definitely could have played that better after seeing it, but we learned from our mistakes, and I'm glad I did it on camera. I'm sure you guys could see where I could have played better, but... All games are a learning experience. So, grab all these guys. Test hand number two. So the reason I like doing best two of three for test hands is just so you can see, hypothetically, it's a match. So we can see how consistent it is in a match. Obviously, there's chances where our opponents are going to draw hand traps or draw... Like maybe, uh, what's that card called? Infinite Impermanence or Evenly Matched, but Ideal Yu Gi Oh! Not a problem. So, shuffle it one more time. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Okay, so. Uh, these are one of the suboptimal hands, honestly. Oh, you know what? <laughs> I lied because I didn't even realize these were in our hand. Um, so we're going to go ahead and activate the sign up mining. You guys have seen the combo. And actually, since we have half the cards in our hand, we can skip half the combo. Sign up mining, activate as effect. We'll just put you to the bottom of the deck because we're going to summon you pretty soon. This is in our hand. Dark Worms effect. Left zone, no effect because we drew our target. Activate it. Normal summon. Use its effect. Summon. Sync. Boom. Activate Ibs effect. We'll search for... We'll search for World Legacy Guard Dragon. Uh... Let's see. Next link 
into lambda. Activate Ibs effect. Summon World Chalice Guard Dragon. Link that away into our LP. Banish Guard Dragon. Let's see if we'll put a banish zone right here. Banish LP. Some of the Guard Dragon Vanilla from our graveyard. Link that away into our Pisty. Uh, next, activate LP's effect. Red Eyes Black or Red Eyes Metal Dragon, Black Metal Dragon. I keep calling it Red Eyes Monster. Link them into our Romulus. Romulus Chain Link 1, Black Metal Chain Link 2. Black Metal will add, go ahead and add. This will focus. There we go. Red Eyes Romulus will go ahead and add. Oh, this autofocus is so bad. Ravine. We'll go back in actually, so we'll go ahead and activate the Ravine. Uh, we'll go ahead and activate this effect. Discard the Red Eyes. Send our. Where are you at? Distrudo. Link. Triple Burst Dragon. Activate Pisty's effect. Summon. Activate his effect. Bring back. Then we can go ahead and link these two into our Darkness Metal Dragon. We're not going to use this effect yet because I'm, I think we could actually potentially end on Triple Flare Metal with the uh, Heretic Link. So next we are going to go ahead and activate Destruido's effect, paying half our life, targeting Black Metal. Sync, that'll go to the bottom. This will go to the graveyard. Summon our Odd Eyes Meteor Burst. Chain Link 1 Meteor Burst Dragon to summon back. Chain Link 2 Black Metal Dragon to search. Let's see what we can get to. We'll add a Red Eyes because we're going to go ahead and summon him back. Then I think what we're going to do next is activate World Legacy Guard Dragon, bring him back, overlay these two into our first Red Eyes, and then link these two into our Heretic Seal. Then we'll activate Black Metal's effect again. We'll add the, uh, what is it, alternative dragon. Next we'll summon our Malefic by banishing a red eyes from our deck. Next we'll summon him by tributing red eyes, overlay these two into our red eyes. I guess I did mess up. Oh well. I mean, at least on this one, we can detach. Summon a red eyes back. So we could have ended on triple flare metal. You guys could see how. But in this instance, we could either end on the heretic or we could end on a uh, three negation Opelousa with Sinet Mining still in our hand. So we did have the potential to end on triple flare metal, but I looked at the play incorrectly. Still, Triple Flare Metal with three negations is not bad at all. And then for our final test hand, I'm trying to make this go as quickly as possible because we are probably hitting about almost a 30 minute video. But comboing is fun and it does fly for me anyways. 
So shuffle a couple times. And I know I've said in every combo video, I like to shuffle on screen just so you guys know I am not trying to cheat you. I do not edit any of these videos like, aside from like the clipping from combo to combo to test hands. I don't do that. I'm just trying to shuffle, show you guys what we can do and combo. Cut the deck. Five cards. Draco net one for one. And um, <laughs> this is interesting actually. So, hmm. We'll go ahead and activate one for one, discarding the Dark Worm. Summoning Black Metal Dragon in the far left. Normal activate effect. I think we could still get there. It's an interesting hand for sure. Sync into him. Activate Ibs effect. Let's get you ready. And you. Where is our, there you are. Add that to hand. Link those into our second Amanda. There you are. Uh, activate Ibs Effect Chain Link 1, Black Metal Chain Link 2, 2, 1. Link this into LB or Pisty. And then in this case, we're actually going to activate World Legacy Guard Dragon to bring back our Black Metal Dragon. And link that one away into our Pisty. Then we're going to activate Black Metal Dragon's effect to search. Malefic. So this is our hand so far. Um, hmm. Go ahead and activate LP's effect. What dragon can we summon? You know, I guess we can actually still go for this. Summon Dark Worm, activate Dark Worm's effect. Add, Kate, add gate zero. Activate it in the far left zone. And then while we're here, we can actually activate Dark Worm in the far right zone. Next, we're gonna link the Dark Worm with the Lambda and the LP. Dark Worm goes to the extra deck into our, oh, that's the wrong deck. Triple Burst. We'll go ahead and activate Pisty's effect. I skipped a step. We're not going to go to Triple Burst. We're going to link these two into our Romulus. And this will go to the extra deck. Activate Romulus's effect. Add the Dragon Ravine. Activate Dragon Ravine. Use its effect, discarding Red MD. Send Destrudo. Um. Link these two. Now we summon our triple burst. Activate Pisty's effect. Bring back Red MD. Activate Red MD's effect. Bring back Black Metal. Link these two off into our Red Eyes Link Monster. Let's see what we can do. 
we'll go ahead and summon the Malefic by banishing a regular Red Eyes. So we'll put our banishes on right there. Uh, we'll go ahead and activate Destrudo's effect. I'm trying to see if we can end on triple flare metal with the Heretic Link again. Well, properly this time. So this is banished and we have scales. So then we'll sink six graveyard. This will go to the bottom of the deck. Into our, or sink seven, sorry. Odd eyes. Uh, Black metal, odd eyes, chain links don't matter. You know, I don't think we are going to be able to end on the heretic link. We shall see, though. So we'll overlay these two. Flare metal. Activate his effect. Oops, skipping steps, I guess. We don't have a red eyes in grave. Hmm. So I guess in this scenario we won't be able to end on flare metal, so we'll activate his effect. Then we're gonna tribute this for the red eyes in our hand. Uh, then activate red eyes' effect. Bring back overlay. Oh, and then I guess this is kind of a bummer because we don't have another red eyes in our graveyard. We can't extend any further than that. So we played ourselves. So that is going to be it for the deck profile, or the, not deck profile, the test hands and combat tutorial video. Uh, obviously, you guys can see where I messed up a little bit better than I did in the moment. But yeah thank you guys so much for watching the test video i know it's been about 30 minutes of watching it but i hope you guys did watch it all the way through um tell me what you guys think of the combos the test hands yes you can criticize me for making incorrect plays obviously i should have made better plays but it's a learning experience you, you learn as you go and i know i've been playing the deck for a while but i've got no excuses i have fun with it uh, thank you guys again so much for watching the video. Remember to like the video, comment down below, subscribe to the channel, and share the channel with your friends. Tell me what you guys would like to see next, and I will talk to you later. Recognize when I wreck a mic, leaving all y'all mesmerized. Killing instrumentals, but nobody wanna testify. In his prime, I think someone better check the guy. Always spitting heat, the beat gon' be hard to identify. Stress minds and wreck mics and leave with the best lines. My sex life is great, cause I spit like a tech nine. Stall competition, beat them with the lead pipe. Sleep on you rappers just like it's my bedtime. You already know that old big bro from the west side. Got you hoes smoking on my flow like a meth pipe. Forever cold, I'll eat your soul like a death side. Headed to the top, shining brighter than a headlight. You better wreck. I'm about to go off, putting on a show and I ain't even trying to show off Here's the red dot, the shot, and kill Rudolph Call me James Bond, cause I killed it with a suit on